My name is Madeleine de Tue. I'm currently employed as a professor at the University of Wollongong in the Welding Engineering Research Group. I always liked science and mathematics growing up, so I always considered a career in science or technology. But I never really thought about engineering until I spoke to a school gui guidance counsellor in high school and he suggested engineering. And I liked the idea. My father's an engineer, he's a mechanical engineer who spent most of his life working for the South African Railways. And um, he inspired me. My proudest achievements, I think the first would be being elected as the president of the Southern African Institute of Welding. I served two terms as president from 2010 onwards, and that was a great opportunity to interact with industry and with, with welding people and to give a bit of direction to, the wel to welding in, in South Africa. I think it's important for women to consider careers in engineering and welding because we don't have enough engineers and we don't have enough highly skilled personnel in welding. Um, there's a perception unfortunately that women don't make good engineers and that's wrong. Um, I've seen that over many years that women make great engineers and we need more women in technical fields as a whole. Um, in terms of welding we have a, a shortage of highly skilled welding personnel we actually have a shortage of personnel over the whole range of welding professions, from welders to inspectors, supervisors, but especially welding technicians and welding engineers. There's still a perception that engineering is a male-dominated field, and to a certain extent, I guess it still is, especially in, in specific disciplines. I've been lucky, though, that I've never really encountered much discrimination. I've never had any real problems. Um, I've also had some really good mentors in the field who helped and supported me uh, while I was studying and also in my early career. And you sometimes do have to work a bit harder to get people to take you seriously. But all in all, my journey hasn't been bad at all. And I think there are now enough female engineers in industry that um, it's becoming a more acceptable career option for girls.